weren't that bad. I mean, some people wanted to hear us sing. He has been hailed by some film critics to be the best young actor in American movies, but has also been reputed to be serious, difficult, and very opinionated. Just the majority of movies really aren't that good today, and that's just a fact. You know, we're all happy because everyone makes a lot of money, and we pretend that the business is in good shape, but it's not. You've even turned down roles that could have resulted in that kind of big hype star making machine getting going on you was that the reason or was it the part that you know, it's the part but yeah, it, it never avoided something because i thought wow that's going to put me up there um it's just those things um weren't interesting as an actor jason patrick turned down the firm instead a well-known tom cruise took the role but patrick has no regrets those movies that the way they turned out as successful as they were um i didn't think they were good the movie he did enjoy is sleepers we need somebody to take the stand and say they were with John and Tommy on the night of the murder. So you figured if you had a priest, it would be perfect? Not just any priest. It is Patrick who tells the terrifying story of a childhood gone awry, and it's grown victims who avenge it. You still sleep with the light on? What do you say, Mike? It's payback time. Patrick, too, has done some growing of his own. The man who once shunned stardom now feels ready to tackle Tinseltown. Are you prepared for the fact that this role could really catapult you into stardom along with you're getting ready to do speed too as prepared you know as you can be i mean i think that it would have been worse i would not have liked to have like uh you know made a movie like that at 20 and then got acting roles now 30 and with a slew of serious acting roles behind him jason is ready to jump into a commercial blockbuster like speed 2. it was just it seemed to be at the right time they caught me at the right moment they were pretty convincing and Sandra Bullock is some you know an added you know plus to that I think may have a little fun with it for a switch Amy Powell for Access Hollywood having fun's important it looks like sleepers is not only a lot of fun but definitely the right choice for Patrick the movie was number one at the box office this weekend earning over 12 million dollars